Hi everybody, it's Devin here at Predatory Plants. My voice is a little raspy because I've been under the weather for the last week or so, but I want to show you something cool. A few weeks ago, I did a video about how to feed Venus flytraps, and I fed one of our plants a pretty hefty centipede, and uh, my coworker Dave pointed out a couple days ago that the trap had opened, so let's go check in on it. So this is the plant that got the centipede, and that's what's left. Uh, just a bit of exoskeleton, um, all of the, uh, the sort of innards have been dissolved up and absorbed by the plant. Uh, it's, it's a nice hefty meal there. Now there's a little bit of mold uh, developing, which is not a big deal. It's just a uh, decomposition because it's you know open in the greenhouse. But it doesn't hurt the plants at all. The plant got a nice meal out of it. Um, at this point, if you uh, had fed your own uh, plant, you could uh, tweeze that out, get some tweezers and pull that out if you didn't uh, want to look at the exoskeleton. But it can just stay there. It's no big deal. Especially because if you look on the, whoops, if you look on the margins of the leaf here, it's starting to brown a little bit right at the base of the hairs. Um, I suspect that this plant uh, will shed that leaf soon because it's a really big meal and, uh, and it's not likely to be able to digest much more than that. And so that leaf will die off and you'll get some more growth from the crown of the plant and you know, nice bit of nutrients from, the, uh, from that meal. So that's what it looks like when you feed your Venus flytrap. Um, like I said, it was closed for, for a little over a week, um, popped back open, and we just noticed it recently. So, uh, hope you found that cool, and if you haven't seen it yet, go check out the original video. If you've got any questions, uh, you know, leave a comment.